winner tonight is Lahela Phelps of Bonnie Lake, Washington, for Forever in My Heart. So uh, it is my great pleasure to announce tonight's Fairfield Mastery Award for Contemporary Artistry. And that goes to, it's called Photographer Darling by Noriko Nozawa of Japan. <laughs> the Baby Lock Master Award for Innovative Artistry, a $5,000 award. Illinois Album by Jane Sassaman of Harvard, Illinois. The $5,000 Master Award for Threat Artistry is Wind by Nas Masanobu Miyamasan. <laughs> and the winner is Quilt Noir, Shirley Giese of Colorado Springs, Colorado. It's always such a thrill to come here and celebrate the beauty and passion of our industry. And it's an honor to be able to get up and give this award. And often it's an international quilter. This evening, we do have an international quilter for the world of beauty. But I'd like to just mention something about eQuilter. First of all, uh, Dana Chapman, our customer service manager, won second place in wearable art. So yay, Dana. <laughs> Congratulations to her. And last year, we exceeded a million dollars raised for charity, so now we're at 1.1 million. And, but also, we're reaching another benchmark, I guess, I hope, of quilts collected and distributed after disasters. And right now, as the quilts flow in for the Colorado flood victims, we're reaching 15,000 quilts. <laughs> So really, we have to give thanks to all the quilters who have just, you know, they immediately respond and send us emails and phone calls. What can we do to help? So thank you for those of you who are sending them to Colorado because, uh, you know, it's always a shock when it happens in your own backyard. I also wanted to mention something. I have a connection to Karen Nyberg. One of the charities that we give to is Engineers Without Borders. We work with the NASA chapter uh, we're supporting an orphanage in Rwanda, and every time I come here, I go out to dinner with the rocket scientists and sometimes an astronaut or two. Last night, I was out to dinner with them, and at 7.38, the alarm went off, and they went, oh, we got to run outside to see the International Space Station. There's an app for that. <laughs> it's ISS Watch, and actually, while I was here, it went off, and then I immediately got a message from uh, Dr. Jack Bacon's wife, Kathy, who said, did you get the message? Can you go outside? And I wrote back, no, I'm at an award ceremony. I have to go on stage in a minute. So we went out and waved at Karen last night at 738. So that's quite a thrill. Anyway, thank you to all the quilters who have contributed to the quilts we've distributed from Katrina to Japan and more recently in Colorado. Thank you so much. Okay, I'm going to take a stab at this. The winner of the $7,500 World of Beauty Award this year, the quilt is Septum Peccata Mortalia, Seven Deadly Sins by Christine Alexou from Markham, Ontario, Canada. Our first Founders Award for $7,500 is the Gorsuch Family Quilt Circa 1840 Revisited by Margot Hardy of Lake Haven, Australia. But this is really fun this year to be able to give a second $7,500 award, um, which is another similar style quilt, but it is called A Letter Bit of Baltimore by Janet Stone of Overland Park, Kansas. Two Baltimore's. The Handy Quilter Best of Show Award is presented to Melissa Sobotka Chilulis Gondola. She's from Richardson, Texas.